Hello, thanks for watching this video. Hercule Sustainability Matters. This credit is EAC1. Energy and Atmosphere Credit 1. Enhanced Commission. This credit related to EAP1. Prerequisite 1. Its name is Fundamental Commission. It's on 321 Lead Before Reference Guide. This credit EAC1 Enhanced Commission contains two options. However, before explaining that, I would like to talk about some basic concepts and requirements, especially both of the requirements between EAP1 and EAC1. Let me put a table on screen. I have passed lead AP exam six times. One of my strategies is to simplify the necessary information like the table. First, please look at the bottom row. If the CXA Commission Authority works directly for the, for the owner of this project, then it's okay for both the fundamental and enhanced commission. Second, please check the vertical column of fundamental. For small projects, it's okay. Then, Check the vertical column of enhanced commission. Only subconsultant and not in design team would achieve this credit. Now let me simplify this table further. We just care about the OK. First, related to owner directly. Second, Fundamental, small project. Third, enhanced, subconsultant and not in the design team. Since the commission authority's responsibility in option one and two are the same, I will compare it with fundamental commission. Let's check the enhanced authorities responsibility first there are eight of them please focus on number four and five i think they should be with number two and three so the older the original order make me unhappy then i just make some adjustment to become a simplified one Fill out some non keywords to become what you see right now. Then let me list the fundamental commission authorities responsibilities and simplify it further. Now let's check the difference between the fundamental and enhanced one. I think it should be easy to understand. Let me formally start to explain option one and two. Option one is enhanced system commission. It contains two passes. Pass one is enhanced commission. Commission process should include the following that I have shown this table before in Fundamental Commission. Please notice that I put both the option 1 and 2 here. Okay. And you can refer to two actuary standards. Actuary stands for American Society of Heating, Refrigerating and Air Conditioning Engineers. Then 
PES2 is enhanced and monitoring best commission. Please be aware that the keyword is monitoring. You must achieve PES1, then list PES2. It focuses on both the energy and water related systems. The commission plan should contain my plan. I just put it here. I don't want to repeat again by speaking. But you need to update your system manual with modifications or new settings. Also, record the reason behind them, why you change them or adjust them. Option two is envelope commission, not the envelope on screen. Okay. We focus on BECF, building envelope commission. This is applied to all of the building projects, but especially for some special types. For example, envelope dominated projects or the projects on extreme climate or microclimate, potential leakage or infiltration of contaminants. This is the same table I showed before. Here we focus on option two, the building envelope. The reference standards are the same, but additionally the NIPS. NIPS stands for National Institute of Building Science. Here are some examples of envelope systems tests, air infiltration, water infiltration, and so on. There are seven of them, but I would like to explain the number three, exhaust, re -entriment. Entriment is the entriment of one substance by another substance. re -entriment is a situation that when we exhaust air outside from the building, immediately you will blow back some air into your system through the air intact and uh, other openings in your building envelope. Let me show you an old fashion reminder. Last but not least, please read steps by steps guidance if you were interested in taking lead AP exam. They are from page 390 to 394, lead B4 reference guide. Thanks for watching this video. Have a nice day. Bye bye.